Good morning, everybody. Mike Vaki, PrincetonTrader.com, here for NTMarkets.com with your Friday morning pre-market webcast. Okay, S&P 500 E-mini futures daily chart. It is 8:17 a.m. We've got the jobs report in about 13 minutes. So I always say, don't game jobs. Don't be placing bets ahead of the jobs report based upon what you, in your amateur economic opinion, think the reaction is going to be to the jobs report. That can go very well for you or very badly. And since people tend to hold trades that go badly a lot longer than they hold trades to go well, you'll probably make $1 for every $4 that you lose. So again, don't game jobs. What you want to do is what we do in the room, which is to find the range, the reaction range, and then see who breaks out above or breaks out below that range and go from there. So the bulls put together a day yesterday. We talked about what was going to happen if they broke above the um, the middle band as they've done so many times before and they made it all the way up to the 58 area which is the area of the weekly pivot 5830 is a weekly pivot at least on my stuff and that's basically where we stalled yesterday's high was 5850 so we pulled back from there about 10 handles and now we're waiting on jobs I would be very interested to see if there is a negative reaction to jobs whether that negative reaction can breach the middle band which now sits at about 41 uh, on the upside you want to see if they can take out 58 half and go from there so there's some very well defined parameters on the upside and the downside for the jobs report and if either side can break through those parameters I would expect them to be able to go ahead and control the remainder of the day if that's the bears and they can move it back down to the 30 30 to 32 area if it's the bulls and you can expect them to go on up and test this high up at 67 quarter and we'll see what they can do with that when they get there okay that's all i've got reports in 11 minutes everybody have a fantastic day fantastic weekend follow us on twitter at princeton trader check out the website princetontrader.com come check out the chat room i'll be back monday morning with another webcast trade them well